Some months ago after the first wave, we were already complacently deeming ourselves pandemic world champions. And now, it's the opposite. We are practically vying to outdo one another in doom and gloom. Does everything really have to be a superlative in Germany? As Goethe put it, now shouting in triumph, now sunk in despair. We're not pandemic world champions, but we're not an utter failure. No, we are the Federal Republic of Germany. We may often have our doubts, but there's plenty we're capable of. And it's our capabilities, not our doubts, which matter now. German President Frank-Walter Steinmeier is set to make a rare appeal to the nation this Easter weekend amid growing frustration with the pandemic. Infections are once again surging in the country with more than 18,000 new daily cases. In a pre-recorded address, which will air on Saturday evening, Steinmeier will ask Germans to overcome what he calls a crisis of trust in the government. The pandemic has held up a mirror to our country, reflecting our compulsion to lay down rules for everything, our fear of taking risks, the shunting back and forth of responsibility. How can we change that? And how can we make our institutions more resilient? We will have to address that. At the moment, however, we are in the midst of the third wave, and it will take all of our strength, all of us together, to overcome it. DW Chief Political Analyst Melinda Crane joins us now to put the German president's remarks into a bit of context for us. Hello to you, Melinda. I'd like to um, go right to what he just uh, said in that clip we played about Germany facing itself in a mirror, reflecting on this compulsion to lay down rules for everything, a fear of taking risks, um, shunting back and forth from responsibility. What is the president driving at? Well, he's essentially driving at what is perceived by many people here in Germany as a constant back and forth course uh, of COVID pandemic management. So uh, we have the minister presidents and the federal government uh, meeting at regular intervals and then issuing pronouncements and then often a couple of weeks later appearing to take back those pronouncements or to modify them or different federal states disagreeing with one another about how to proceed and in fact, the German Constitution vests primary health policy responsibility in the federal states. But the fact is that uh, there's been a lot of tussling between them and the federal government about whether to tighten restrictions, loosen restrictions. And many citizens have the sense that leadership is missing, and therefore that is why the president uh, issued what is a pretty uh, clear warning or even a scolding to politicians, coupled with concern about, as you said, a crisis of trust. We have another short clip from these uh, pre-recorded remarks. Let's have a quick listen. We must all pull together, my fellow Germans. We must give it everything we've got. There's no use merely being outraged about others or about our leaders. Rather than constantly pointing out what doesn't work, we should point out that things do work when everyone does their bit. That is what I am talking about when I talk about trust. Because ultimately, trusting in a democracy means nothing other than trusting in ourselves. All right, Melinda, so you said uh, just before it's clear that Steinmeier is addressing at least partly German politicians. In this clip we just heard, he's talking a lot about trust and also urging Germans not just to focus on what's going wrong with the pandemic response. What is his underlying message here and who is it targeted at? Well, it's essentially targeted uh, at uh, both uh, German citizens, uh, but also at uh, German politics, uh, essentially saying, look, Easter is a time for hope, uh, and there is every reason to be hopeful. The vaccine rollout is now gathering speed. Many people will have the opportunity to be vaccinated, but essentially he's saying for them to avail themselves of that opportunity, they need to trust. trust Trust in the vaccines, trust in the judgment of political leaders, and therefore he's essentially melding these two, hope and trust. And 
it's crucial to know the German president doesn't set policy himself. He's essentially the moral compass of the nation, and that's why he's speaking to these overriding themes, hope and trust. DW's chief political analyst, Melinda Crane, thank you so much.